You can achieve anything in life if you do these two things. Number one, receive an opportunity. Number two, have a chance to work very hard. Marita was a little girl raised in the poorest part of New York, South Bronx. She lived alone with her mom in a one bedroom studio. Her mom worked two jobs and she was barely making it. There was no one in her family who had been to college. Her mom wanted a better future for her. That is why she was enrolled in KIPP. KIPP took students from the poor neighborhoods and turned them into mathematics superstars. 80% of their graduates received scholarships and went to college, but this required a lot of hard work. After Marita joined KIPP, this is how her schedule looked like. She woke up at 5 a.m., took a bus at 6 a.m., started school at 7 a.m., and finished at 5 p.m. Got home at 6 p.m., and she would work on her homework until 9 p.m. If it is difficult homework, then she would only be done around 11 p.m. Then she does it all over again the next day. She goes to school also on weekends and holidays. Marita is just a 12-year-old girl. Marita understands that if she could grab this opportunity and work very hard, she will achieve great things. Malcolm Gladwell says she kept the same hours as an attorney trying to make a partner or as a resident doctor. You might be thinking there are many people who work hard but never succeed. That is why Marita needed KIPP to provide access to scholarships and the community that encourages hard work. That is exactly what Pathway does. Brother Charles from Ghana, none of his family members went to college. When Brother Charles was about to finish his mission, he was worried about finding employment. His family did not have funds to send him to school and was not sure how he was going to be successful. Nearing the end of his mission, he received an email that invited him to join the pathway worldwide. He registered the week before the end of his mission. A week after he got home, he attended his first in-person gathering. The gathering helped increase his faith and gave him hope. Pathway also helped him stay close to the Lord the same way he did while he was on mission. It was not easy the first semester because he only had a smartphone to work with. During the second semester, he could not use his smartphone anymore because his coursework was more advanced. He was unable to buy a laptop because he had a low income job. This is when he asked his friend to borrow his laptop. The only time he could use a laptop was in the evening. He would go to the chapel after work to borrow the friend's laptop. He had to wait for his friend to finish studying, then use the laptop afterwards. After most days, he would get home at 11 p.m. at night. Sometimes he would, he would spend the whole night at the chapel. He, he never gave up because he knew that it was going to change his life. He was very grateful to be given an opportunity and a chance to work very hard. Soon afterwards, he was blessed with the scholarship that provided laptops. After finishing his first certificate, he was blessed with a job as a quality assurance specialist for the family history department of the Africa West Area Office. Now he's a first generation university student and is almost finished with his second certificate. Very soon he'll be doing his associate and bachelor's degree. That's what Pathway does. It helps you succeed by giving you an opportunity and a chance to work very hard. When Amon decided to become King Lamona's servant, he was assigned to watch over the flock with other Lamanite servants. After three days, after grazing the flock, they decided to take the flock to water at a place called Sebus. When they got there, a group of Lamanites scattered their flocks. King Lamona's servant began to weep because the king was going to kill them. Amon did what Kip did to Marita, or what Pathway did to Brother Chris. Amon encouraged his fellow servants and told them that it was possible to gather the scattered flock. Then he ran after the flock and the other servants followed. They were able to capture the flock and gather all of them. Emon helped them believe that it was possible, the same way that Pathway does for those who think it's impossible to go to university or even to succeed in life. But the servant had to put in hard work by running as fast as they could to gather the flock. The servant were blessed to have Emon. We are blessed to have Pathway. It will bless our lives when we have faith and work very hard.